Good morning, beloved. Welcome to Successful Living. There has been some terrible tragedies that happened in Texas recently due to the recent storm and the tornado. Um, houses being devastated, lives being lost. But I just want to have a word of comfort for you during this time, knowing that God is the God in a time of trouble. And let me say that again. God is the God in the time of of trouble. Psalms 57 verse 1 says, Be merciful unto me, Lord, O God, be merciful unto me, for my soul trusting in thee, and in the shadow of thy wings will I make my refuge until these calamities be overpassed. Now, if you turn to Psalms 63 verse 7, 91 uh, verse 1, you see this recurring theme that when times get tough, when winds blow, when the storms Come, God is a God that still overshadows his people and watch out for you. I can tell you many times when the storm has come in my life. I can tell you times when we have been trapped by snowstorm and calamity hit my family that God was a God of refuge. And I can say this, not just because the scripture says so, but I can say by my own experience that God is the God over calamity. That he's the one that we hide ourselves in, in the times of a storm. And what do I mean by that? Practically, is when you find yourself in a difficult situation, when you find yourself between a rock and a hard place, when you find yourself storm waters coming up, snow coming down, and the whirlwind is in your life, God is a God that you can run to in a time of trouble because he would give you peace of mind. He would give you sound wisdom. You could be in the middle of a desert dying and God was seeing a Coca-Cola right to you with ice. I'm trying to tell you, I know this for a fact. That God sees you. He knows your trouble. He knows what you're going through. He just wants you to do the trust in him and the power of his might and to call on his name. And you will see miraculous things happen. Yes, houses blow down. Yes, cars catch on fire. Yes, Calamities happen, but God will see you through because the things of this life, the pains of this world, the agony of this world is not forever. And God has a place for there where there's no more tears, no more crying. He is the God. He is the overlord of the calamity. And we can trust in him and we can trust in his shadow of his wings and we can make refuge underneath God in a time of a storm. God is the God of troubled times. He has been a strength for those in poor. He has been a strength for the needy in distress. He is a refuge from a storm. He is a shadow from the heat. And when the blast of the terror one comes as in a storm, God is against the storm. Storms come. We lose material things. But God is able to, to replace anything that's made out of matter because he is the God and creation of the whole earth. God is able to turn any calamity with the end. God would turn around so that he may get the glory. And the way God gets glory is by having his name excellent in the earth, by watching over his people. Beloved, I'm saying, I don't know what you're going through right now. I don't know what you're facing right now. It could be monstrous medical bills. It could be a wayward child. It could be calamity. It could be a storm that comes in the middle of the night while you're sleeping. You could have lost a loved one, but I'm saying God is still on the throne. God is still able to do exceedingly, abundantly, all that we ask or think. My name is Blaine C. Van, and know that God is the God in times of trouble, and we can put our trust in Him.